Hey, Tommy. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. You aren't kidding. Corner Draft House. It Corner all makes sense. House. I know. And great <laughs> menu. Great Bloody Marys. Let's go check it out. All right. Let's see. Uh, Well, Mike, we're happy to be here. I'm happy to be introduced to your favorite pub. Definitely it is. You know, I used to office not too far from here, sold in this building. This is a great area. We're right next to Balboa Park and all the activities in Bankers Hill. And it's not every day we get to meet one of the owners, right? Managing uh, partners. That's yeah. right. Yeah. This is my buddy, Dave Creviston. Yep. He's been kind enough to open up his doors for us today. Absolutely. Thanks for having us. So how did you get Great started you guys here. here? Is this your first restaurant business? Uh, third one for me. I had the first one in Bankers Hill, north of downtown. Was in PB for years and then up in North County as well. We have a sister restaurant called Beer Garden of Encinitas. So yeah, we're excited to be here. We're coming up on our three year anniversary and We've been really excited to be a part of the community here and all the new development. And, you know, I think we think it's one of the best neighborhoods sprouting up, as Mike knows, yeah. in, in Bankers. So. Yeah. Mike was saying he does a lot of business here and watched it grow and develop within Bakers Hill. Yeah. I mean, just the last five to ten years, you've really seen it blossom. And um, so many, you can just look around and see so many great, you know, luxury high rises coming up, which we've never had here, yes. not only in San Diego, but especially in Bankers Hill. Although Bankers Hill was initially named Bankers Hill because it was an area of affluence many, many years ago when the city got started. What would you say was your number one goal when creating Draft House? What did you want to bring to the people? Just a local, really great spot where you could sit down at the bar and feel comfortable with whoever you came in with, as well as meet new people. Um, it's a place where you, you know your bartender and they know your drink and uh, or what type of food you like and you're also easily you know, meeting someone new or someone visiting. You know, we're so close to the airport. Yeah, I guess that's, you know, bringing people together. I know, love it. In, I know Mike great neighborhood it here. setting. Yeah. Everybody knows your name here. <laughs> yeah. The mugs, you got your name in a mug, right? Yeah, it's yeah a, what's with the mugs? Well, that's a big thing people, you know, like to have. We have a list normally waiting for people to get, get a mug, but basically you have your own mug when you come in. We're that kind of a local neighborhood spot where you can come in and the bartender knows number, which number your, your mug normally is and you get a free beer on your birthday. And, as well as a 10% discount um, awesome. when you have your own mug. So <laughs> is it a people, club? Yeah, absolutely it is. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you get a I one year membership. You get a one year membership and there's ways to get your name on a plaque on the bar as well and we do a lot of fun things like that. So It really is like you said, the cheers almost yeah. of Bankers Hill. Norm comes in every once in a while, <laughs> hangs out with Cliff Clay, but you bet. We have all types. Right. All and types I'm sure of Mike can attest to this. Right. I feel like they needed something like this here in Bankers Hill. Yeah, you know, it's a very um, a lot of higher end restaurants here and uh, you know, you got Mr. A's right across the street, wonderful spot. But this is a real um, people's kind of place where you can just nuzzle up and watch sports and the menu is fantastic by the way. It's Thank a you. wonderful menu. To everybody that comes in and I think you know Mike can attest or anybody that's ate here the food is exactly that. It's Phenomenal. Very fresh and very good. This yeah. Bloody Mary has its, its huge reputation. Oh yeah too. five different types of them. <laughs> you bet. Yeah we infuse bacon and cheddar in some of our vodkas. And well we have what's called a, it's a secret. Yeah. Secret Bloody Mary. That's probably secret. what they say. Everything's a yeah. secret. Oh. You know, <laughs> but no, they, they, they definitely come out with some specials on the weekend that are, you know, they're trying to have a little fun with it, get a little creative. Everything from chicken wings to shrimp to beef sticks. So, yeah. <laughs> right? Everybody loves that. Yeah. Why not? Especially when you're watching football on Sunday or you just want to sit out on a dog friendly patio with your pooch. And, you know, we have two nice sidewalk cafes in the back patio back there. So. Even a dog menu now. So. Dog friendly? Yeah. Dog absolutely. friendly. Wow. Yeah. That's well, big in this neighborhood as well. A lot of we people have a like dog with a big reputation who yeah. follows this man I around know. over here. <laughs> She's very demanding though, so yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Is that um, dog menu high a lot end? Of, a lot of dogs are, yeah. absolutely. Oh, you get salmon, right. you get the, the best of everything. Oh, so it's yeah, so imperfect. <laughs> yes. Yep, in her own bowl. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thanks for having us here. Yeah, thank you very much. Thanks for you guys coming in. And hopefully we can enjoy something after the interview here. Actually, uh, when I mentioned that we were coming here for lunch, my wife heard alcohol and she hopped in her car and just <laughs> got the dog and she's here with us. So she, I think she's going to... like a very I smart think, and lovely woman. I, she, Who, yeah. drove <laughs> Thank you. Who drove the dog? Who drove the dog, Amy? Yeah, that's true. Well, the Who dog knows? will probably drive home. Okay, there you go. <laughs> I think we need to see Amy then. Yeah, yeah. let's go. Absolutely.
Wow, it's amazing what you show up for. You got <laughs> Bloody Marys and Fiona's well, here for the food. I this see. is definitely where it's coming from. I can tell. Look at this. These are amazing. Fiona's eyeing that bacon now <laughs> too. We may have to pull this off for her right here. All right, Fiona, you could have it. Oh, yeah, she loves bacon too. Yeah. <laughs> And I love what David was saying. So you came from out of town, but there's so many people right here that they built their whole company off the market that was happening right here at Baker's Hill. Oh yeah, we've sold in this building, as we mentioned mm -hmm. earlier, and um, all around Mission Hills and Hillcrest and Bankers Hill. Such a great area, and the market is in really good shape right now. I is think it? there was a lot of concern last year about you know rates going up towards the end of the year. Since then, mar the rates have pulled back. And the market's doing pretty well. I think it's, uh, it's going to be a decent year. It's not going to be a huge year, but it's going to be a decent year in San Diego. That's good news, right? Good news for your buyers. Good news for the buyers. They are excited. We had a little hesitation in the beginning of the year, but I think now that they've seen that the rates are steady and prices are steady, they're more motivated. They're getting more excited again. I love it. Yeah. So how about a big cheers to uh, the market in 2019? Let's and Bloody Marys. <laughs> and more <laughs> Bloody Marys, yeah. Right? Cheers. cheers. Oh, man down. <laughs> you can't eat and have it. Oh. There goes my cleanse.